hawajawahi piga rozi hata hao hao vijana wangu wawili mimi nawapendanga sana hata nikipatanga pesa nilikuwa natuma huko nyumbani hata nilikuwa naenda saa zingine huko siaya natembelea yeye huko unaona mimi hata sijawahi piga rozi hata kama ni kumpiga tuseme tu nishawahi nishai msukuma na unajua pia mama saa zingine hao wanawake wanakosanga good people karibu ni sana guys mumesikia that is lozi ex husband uh, kabla sasa a travel aende kufanya kazi golf by the way i hope mnasikia mlisikia venye alisema kuwa uh, ye yeah, ali travel golf cuz yani walikuwa nasubuana sana na bwanake na ndio aka akasikia amechoka na akaamua ku travel acha niniwaambie guys Uh, wachana wengi especially wenye wanafanya kazi huku golf watu wengi ni wenye wametoka kwa marriages zao mtu unapata ukiwa pale unadharauriwa uonekani yani mwanaume akuoni kama we ni mtu na acha niniwaambie most of the time watu wengi wakikuja na huku wanakuanga so so heartbroken na ndio mnaonanga watu wengi like uh, 90% yani wakitoka hizi nchi huwa wamebarikiwa sana yani na wanaenda mbali unaona and um, Unasikia venye anasema hapo yani yeye hajawahi mpiga but alimrusha unaona atu au wanawake sometimes wafanya nini hukosea unaona inakuanga hivyo saa hizi saa hizi haezi sema kitu alifanya but Dania Rossi si Rossi anasema what happened yeye ana, mwenyewe anajua na kama ni mtu mzuri you know Rossi anaweza mu accommodate lakini kama si mtu mzuri hakuna venye hiyo uh, time hakumpenda ama haku care about her with her kids alafu saa hizi akuja kwa rafiki ya Rosi cuz Rosi saa hizi ame trade hmm? acheni niwaambie sometimes nasemanga Mungu anaweza tenda kitu ndio utoke akutoe tu mali anaona tu unafinyirika yani anatenda tu kitu once anakutoa hapo na kutoka tu hapo yani unapata Mungu anakuinua kukuinua saa hizi sasa bwana ya Rosi anaangalia na ana eh hey, Rosi ashakuwa msika celebrity hmm? ndio huyo sasa anaenda Canada Mm. by the way na nime, nimeona ati visa imetoka ya kwenda Canada. So bwanake anamwangalia tu hivi anaona uoi, yani umeomoka tu, kaniacha tu hapa. But the moment alikuwa pale alikuwa na shida. The moment alikuwa pale na watoto wake, huyo mwanaume ye yeah, hakumuona kama ni mtu. Naona na by the way wanaume wengi wanaonanga wanawake hivyo. By the way sitaki kusema tu wanaume because pia wanawake kuna wenye wako hivyo. But most of the time kuna wana wa, wanaume ware wanaangalianga as in mtu anakuangalia uko pale ushaza mtoto wa kwanza umezaa wa pili ndio huyo uko watatu yani akikuangalia tu hivi anakudharau by the way mimi niko na bishte yangu ha, anafanya kazi huko Iraq na size i think ako na oh, like more than six years akifanya kazi huko yeye alikuwa ananipatia story akaniambia the moment yani alitoka kwa bwanake yani hata wale wajawahi fikiria kurudi Cuz yani alikaa pale unaona ile time una, unakuwa na shida mtu anakwambia toka uende but huwezi toka utatoka uende wapi eh? anakwambia ni sikupate but atakuja tu ampate kwa hiyo nyumba naona huyo mwanaume huyo uh, demo alikuwa ananiambia bwanake alikuwa anamwambia sasa wewe unaweza enda wapi na watoto na watoto wawili unaweza enda wapi hmm? ebu jiangalia venye umekaa venye umeparara but yeye akitoka huko nje akawa na wanawake watatu wainne huko nje naona yeye ako free was udem sasa ko pare na na watoto wake bwanake anamuona as in sio mtu but let me tell you ile time alirudi na alafu hiyo time bwanake alikuanga na pesa by the way watu wenye wana huwa wanalingia watu cuz wako na pesa acha niniwaambie pesa ni maua sometimes yani unaweza ringia mtu Mungu akuja afanye kitu yani uishe kabisa huo mwanaume Mungu alifanya hivyo. Huo demo akakuja na huku yeye akafanya kazi at least akakuwa maisha yake iko sawa. But ule bwanake Maria vyenyari muacha. Yaani alimwacha shida ikamkula. Maria alikuwa anafanya kazi akafutwa. Nyumba yenye alikuwa na akatoka akaenda kwa ka single room kama bati. Shida ikamkula. Na ujue huo demo akitoka Kenya walikuwa wanakaa kwa two bedroom. Hmm? So shida ilimkula ikamkula. Hmm? Unaona sasa bwana ya Rusia anaangalia Rosi hivi anasema woi guy I wish hmm? I wish ningekaa na wewe aishi ningewaonyesha love lakini hiyo opportunity haingekuja maybe kama angekuwa na yeye hmm? ilikuja kuzua alimtendea madharau mpaka akatoka pale akaenda mahali pengine unaona 
Depe na watu wazuri ni wazuri. Kwa zero si hata ukiangalia udem hata kama ni kazi ukiangalia the connection yako na wale watoto. Wewe unaona tuna charity ni mtu mzuri. Hmm? Ni mtu mzuri. So guys, acheni niwaambia kuna kitu poa kama ku treat. Unaona ule mtu mko na yeye. Hmm? It doesn't matter its family. It doesn't matter kama ni jirani, kama ni ni mtoto wako, kama ni mama wako, kama ni babako wa treat treat au watu vizuri unaona si lazima upatie mtu kitu but kuna ile hata kama ni kuongea ongelesha mtu vizuri kuwa na respect unaona kuwa na ile upendo yani show love to people unaona cause acha ni niwaambie you never know you never know like pale na ni pale lozi alikuwa anafanya kazi pale Lebanon unapata huo msichana hakuna kitu like kubwa angepatia unaosikia huo huo boss wake alisema nini Arisema yeye hata hizo gift watu wanapeana online yeye yeah, she I don't deserve hmm? give to those people who deserve them ataki ataki cause ya kombele unaona but Lozi alienda pale and what she gave ni kitu yenye hawakuwa nayo ni kitu yenye hata hawangeweza kununua kwa kwa kupatia watoto wao unaona ni love ariwapatia just love kitu yenye tu alikuwa nayo ya kuofa cause yeye ana pesa ati anaweza wapatia unaona but love aribapatia na ndio imemfikisha hapo amefika acha niniwaambie saa hizi losi eh hey, uo dem saa hizi ana sign my deal deal after deal deal after deal ha eh hey, saa hizi ni superstar acha niniwaambie na siku moja tu hivyo Mungu amemchangia rifle hmm. we mambo ya Mungu hmm. mambo ya Mungu acha ninayo yeah but unajua pia yeye she have uh, work she have worked so hard kuonyesha watoto upendo si ati ni kitu tu inakuja tu hivi hapana ni kitu yenye pia yeye amefaitia so guys we iko hivyo and uh, i'm so happy for her mungu aendelee tu kumbariki kumuinua you know she deserve she deserve to be happy she deserve to stay with her kids yani she deserve all all all, all the best because you know pia yeye amefanya kazi poa kwa na wale watoto kwa treat vizuri. Mi nasemanga kwa hii dunia kuna kazi ngumu kama kukaa na watoto. Hii hiyo kazi ni ngumu watu wangu. Kwa sababu unapatanga hata ile time wewe mwenyewe unafaa rest. You can't rest. Hmm? Utakuwa pale juu ya watoto, you can't even rest. Hmm. So I'm so happy for her na wishing her all the best. Yeah. So guys, kindly subscribe, share my video, like and comment, share your thoughts. Na tafulaia sana. So bye bye. Take care.